Aha. Uh -huh. And what's Abby. Harry's sister's name? So this is a C chord. You remember the C chord? And this is a G chord. Do you agree? Yeah. And then we just do another G chord. And we're going back to C. And we're on our way to the F. But before we go to the F, we're going to go to the E minor chord. Okay, put your thinking hats on. E minor. Is it going to have a black note in the middle or not? No black note. What do you think? Everybody, do you all agree? No black note? Yeah. No, Happy. Right. And it comes in here, Hannah. Make sure you're a little bit in front of Jack. Shell, we got your little sister who turned one, and who's the third person? Um, your uncle. Okay, here. Maybe that's lucky then that we're about to play it in a certain way that has the word three in there. See how there's three candles? Okay, I'm going to explain that in a sec. But first, I'm going to show you the G11. We have just gone happy. I'm going to go from E minor to F. The left hand is going to go to the G. Birthday to you. How nice does that sound? Can you see that? Guess what it's called? G11. G11. Everybody go G11. G11. Yeah. G11. Because I'm playing my first note, my third note, my fifth note, not my sixth, my seventh, my ninth, and my eleventh. Like that F over G. You play F 
in the right hand and G in the left hand. Yeah, does that make sense? Let me give you that handout also. Oh, I know. Oh, I better send you that video of Carousel. Well, maybe that, yeah, thank you. Sorry. Maybe that's because I'm the best version of the Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah and I gave you the easier version. So the, the E minor is new. Yeah? Everybody have a go with that on your keyboard once you got that? You are free to go. Oh, I think Rochelle is going to like this video.